NV Core Barrel Assembly. NV inner tube cap assembly. Insert the grease fitting or zerk into the appropriate hole in the inner tube cap assembly. Tighten the grease fitting with a ratchet until it is wrenched tight. Place the ball inside of the box end of the inner tube cap assembly. Now take the check valve body and thread it to the box end of the inner tube cap assembly. Place the inner tube cap assembly in a vise. Now take your crescent wrench and tighten the check valve body until it is wrench tight. This completes the NV inner tube cap assembly. NV head assembly. Thread the lock nut onto the spindle. Place the spindle in a vise. Now place the shutoff valves and adjusting washers onto the spindle shaft in the following order. Shutoff valve, adjusting washer shutoff valve, adjusting washer. Place the thrust bearing on the spindle so it comes to rest with the moving side down against the adjusting washer. Place the spindle bearing on the spindle with the threads facing up toward the threads of the spindle. Install the hanger bearing on the spindle with the open side of the hanger bearing facing up towards the threads of the spindle. Now place the compression spring onto the spindle. The lock nut is now threaded onto the spindle and tightened with the appropriate sized wrench until it's wrench tight. Only tighten the lock nut until the compression spring has limited travel. Place the inner tube cap assembly on the spindle. Thread the inner tube cap assembly onto the spindle bearing. Take the head and place it in a vise. Thread the bearing assembly to the box end of the head. Thread the lock nut so it butts against the head. Be sure to tighten the lock nut with an appropriate sized wrench until it's wrench tight. This completes the NV head assembly. NV inner tube assembly. After securing the inner tube in a vise, Place the core lifter inside of the core lifter case. Please note that the end style core lifter case has one scribed line. Slide the stop ring inside of the core lifter case until it is seated on its designated groove. Now thread the core lifter case to the pin end of the inner tube. Take your inner tube wrench and tighten the core lifter case on the inner tube until it's wrenched tight. Now take the final head assembly and thread it inner tube cap assembly first to the inner tube. Be sure to tighten the final head assembly 
to the inner tube using your inner tube wrench until it is wrench tight. This completes the NV inner tube assembly. NV final core barrel assembly. After securing the outer tube in a vise, take the inner tube stabilizer and place it inside the thread protector. Now thread the thread protector to the pin end of the outer tube. Take the inner tube assembly and place it core lifter case first into the outer tube assembly. Take the head and thread it onto the outer tube. This completes the NV core barrel assembly. For more information or to get a written version of this instructional video, please visit our website at www.atlascopcoexploration.com.